you know, dude, Indians will use Indian terms to support and buttress their lies. So you didn't you didn't volunteer at the Cinemark. You volunteered at the Hari Temple. It's exactly. very important. It's very important. Exactly. Because the same way we lie yeah. use, uh, leveraging American culture to our parents, we leverage Indian culture, culture to, to the whites. white people. Dude, one time I, I, we were doing this. Um, these are lessons, by the way, for any people. younger South Asians listening. These are the things you have to do. Leverage the culture. Lie, bitch. Okay, as you lie. This is what works. So one time we were doing this um, uh, fashion show kind of thing. Like me and my a couple of friends were doing this fashion show for the uh, Miss Pl- Mr. Plano. It's kind of like the pageant for like hot white jocks relief at the end of the year. But we wanted to get in. We're like, yo, fuck these white guys. Let's fucking... Do this like let's like me and my couple of good brown friends. We like let's just go into this pageant and like like make a mockery of it a little bit, right? So our idea that's gutsy because you grew the, up in Texas. Dude, 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 no, for real, for real. So we were like, yo, fuck these white football jocks. So we do this thing. Where we're like, we're all gonna wear like um, women's clothes, like like maxis and like super like night nightgowns. Like What's a maxi. Maxi is like one, like a like a like one of those gowns that uh, women sleep in. Mm-hmm. You know, like, like, okay, like one of those yeah. like. With the flowery top, right, and it's, yeah. like, it's like a, a grandma a nighty, gown. A nighty, a nighty. It's, it's yeah. a grandma gown, right? Yeah. Basically, so we wear all that. Put on makeup. We put on um, uh, Gunter's "Ooh, you like my tralala, my ding ding dong." Remember that? The, there's a German dude who makes this fucking overtly. <laughs> say, <laughs> uh, that, Ooh, you like my tralala, my ding ding dong, right? And so we play that, and we have this fucking raunchy ass fashion show, and we do we do it as a dress rehearsal to like uh, get past. For the final cut, right? Right. So we do. We go into the audition, and uh, we 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 go do it, right? And we do this fucking crazy, fucking insane, like uh, drag, totally disrespectful to the whole to thing. everybody, it everybody like to anybody and everybody, everybody right? And then uh, the white lady who runs it comes up to us, stops the music midway, and she's like, "What are you guys? What is this? What are you guys doing?" I swear to God, I'm like, "Oh, this is just an Indian custom." <laughs> Bro, when I say her <laughs> face went, oh, HR, <laughs> you racist bitch. Wow, this is our, the uh, during uh, the Wally Festival of Drag. Festival of Drag. So what you just said right there, very offensive. And uh, again, lying, again, if you're going to lie, you make them feel shitty. Exactly. you got to make them feel exactly. shitty. You can't. Oh, now there's a term yeah. for it. It's called gaslighting. Gaslighting. Yeah. You, you gaslight it, right? Yeah. Uh, and yes, you fucking, we gaslit this bitch. And uh, she was like, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. Yeah. yeah. And exactly. it, w- it was so guilty for her that she passed us. Because if she hadn't said the... And she's she, a racist. She's a ra- exactly. She's a, she's a racist. And she's going to be on the news. Yep. Yep. ABC yep. News. Her name NBC was News. Miss Jackson. Miss Jackson. We're sorry, Miss Jackson. Sorry, Miss Jackson. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I was <a> lying. 